Good morning, I am off to Oxford this morning. I'm on the way to Paddington and I'm looking a bit sleepy so I'm definitely gonna chirp up after I have a bucket of coffee in my hand. Uh, but heading over to Paddington Station, it's gonna be an hour on the train and I'm just gonna explore Oxford for the day with my sisters. So I'm very, very excited about that because I've wanted to go there for a long, long time. It looks so beautiful. Thought I'd take you along with me because it's a very, very good day trip to take from London. I've never been before so you can see it for the first time with me. Super autumny down here, look. Look at all those autumn leaves. Um, so yeah, very, very excited about that. And let's hop on the tube right now and get ourselves a big cup of coffee. Wish smell of vision existed so you can smell the coffee with me and refine some with me, but alas, not yet. But without further ado, let's go because I'm just rambling now. <laughs> finally have a seat. It was an absolute palaver at Paddington. The platform was changed, suddenly they decided that the train was going to leave five minutes early from a different destination. The train was round full of people like shouting and trying to get on both sides. It's a bit crazy, I haven't had coffee yet. <laughs> so I was just like, it's too early for this. Um, so now we are on the way. The Oxford should be about 45 minutes now. And as soon as I go down, I'm gonna get something to eat and something to drink. I'm very excited. So yeah, I'm gonna read my book. And enjoy the rest of the trading. Look at the little cute baby apples. They look like tomatoes. Oh, what a shot, sunflower, yes. Oh, at the pools. So if you want to see us, it's going to be the next video. But right now we just went down George Street which is full of restaurants and cafes and pubs. So much food choices. Um, and they've got loads of good range, they've got chains, they've got independent stuff. Right now we're looking for a Thai place called Chiang Mai. Um, and we are down the main high street I think and it is popping. The market here is super super busy and everywhere you turn there's just beautiful architecture and buildings and stuff. So keep whipping up the camera and shooting bits whenever I can. And so far first impressions, love it. Busy, beautiful, busy. <laughs> Had Thai to start, which looks delicious. Thai green chicken curry, red curry beef with like Thai cheese and pineapples, and then also the venison jungle curry, and two little pots of sticky rice. I love these. This is about the past 10 minutes doing like typical model poses down this hallway. Oh, so funny, I'm starting to cry. And now we're gonna explore the city centre some more and try and find the colleges. spot and a very very popular tourist spot. This is the Radcliffe camera and it's part of the University of Oxford. This bridge is called the Bridge of Sighs. My mum asked if the reason why it's called that is because students get too hard studying and so they have to do a sigh. I don't know, but very, very iconic view of Oxford. This is another college called Mansfield College and it is so peaceful and beautiful. 
I think they're currently building some stuff over there though but apparently there's a rumour that you're not allowed to walk on the grass unless you're a professor or a graduate not too sure if that's a myth or not but I'm staying off just in case apparently the door automatically opens so we're gonna see <gasps> so cool it is like a Harry Potter <laughs> so this is what it looks like inside the college I honestly feel like I've stepped into what Harry Potter would look like look at the features on the ceiling <sighs> literally looks like Harry Potter This is the uh, cocktail menu from inside the college and look at these puns. Treasure Island iced tea, Lord of the Mai Tais, the joy of sex on the beach, one flew over the cosmos nest, tequila, mockingbird, that's the best one. This is crime and punishment. This is, I love this so much. <laughs> that my sister is coming here. I feel like the proudest big sister ever for having two super, super smart, intelligent, amazing young women as my sisters. Uh, we're taking for a walk right now and I'm just literally just like looking at everything in awe. And it's so beautiful here and it's just so much history. Ah, I love it. <laughs> it's really peaceful here as well. Everyone's kind of just plodding along, getting on with life and just love it here. Absolutely love it here. Can't wait to come visit her all the time, especially at Christmas when they've got like fairy lights and all decorations and it's just gonna look so magical here. So can't wait to do that. We've just found Oxford University Park. going through this canal. Oh, there's a train going by. Oh, is that the platform? I think this is the platform up there. Ooh. I'm scared of hitting my head. I'm like ducking. <laughs> it's the first time I'm too tall for anything. It's very cool. Flies. I don't want to be near the flies. Oh, where's the flies? <laughs> we are now walking back to fire the canal route and this is the most spectacular view. Although, I'm pretty sure it'll be a bit scary at night, but look! These people are just casually rowing boats in the distance. <laughs> 